Okay, so now we're going to discuss about examples of applications of maximum and minimum. Okay, we have here example number one. What number exceeds its square by the maximum amount? Okay, so solution natin. Then, uh, previously, dun sa maxima and minima, meron na tayong agad na, meron tayong agad na function. Dito, problem ang nakalagay. And we have to analyze and evaluate the problem to convert its, to its uh, function. Okay? So, solution, let, let x be the number. Okay? So, yung x, yan yung tinutukoy dito na number. And then, uh, and the difference, the difference, d is equivalent to x minus x squared. Okay? So, therefore, ito na yung ano natin, yung solution natin. Ay, yung function natin. Okay? Paano naging ganyan? Di ba sabi natin kanina, si x, yun si uh, number natin. And it, say, it states here, exceeds its square. So, ibig sabihin, mas mataas si x compared kay x square. Kasi, it's square, sabi niya. So, ibig sabihin si x, i-square natin. Okay? And then, since meron na tayo, pwede na natin siyang i-derive. So, d, d, over dx is equivalent to 1 minus 2x. Okay? So, 1 minus 2x. So, derivative ni x, 1, and then ni 2x, ay, x squared is 2x. And then, yun nga, equate natin siya sa 0. So, 1 minus 2x equivalent to 0. So, uh, negative 2x equivalent to 0. So, negative 2. Ah, di ba na? 1 to. Di ba? Negative 1. Negative 2. So, x is equivalent to 1 half. And then, substitute natin to sa ano natin? Formula. So, d Ayan. Substitute natin. Okay. So, dito, hindi na natin kukunin yung critical points. Okay? So, ito ay considered as the answer na. Okay? Ans. Ngayon, next na step natin is is a second derivative natin siya. So, therefore, d is squared d over dx squared. Okay? So, second derivative, we have negative 2. Yan ang second derivative natin. Wherein, negative 2 is less than 0. Okay? So, therefore, therefore, d is a maximum. Diba? Maximum when when uh, x is equivalent to 1 half. Okay? So, highlight natin ito. Maximum siya. Okay? Next, another example. Example number 2. Okay? So, example number 2. What positive number added to its reciprocal gives the minimum sum? Okay, so on dito, minimum sum naman dapat. So, solution natin. So, positive number. So, let x, or let, let x be the number. Be the number. And then, and what number gives the minimum sum? And s. And s is equivalent to Sabi niya dyan, uh, gives the minimum sum. A number, so yung number natin, x, 
Tapos, what positive number added to its reciprocal? So, i-add natin yung reciprocal niya plus 1 over x. Reciprocal na x, 1 over x. Okay? Then, yun na si s natin. The sum. Ito yung the sum. Okay? Ulitin ko. Let x be the number and s uh, s is equivalent to the sum. Wherein, dito sa s, ang equivalent siya sa x plus 1 over x. Okay? Saan so, nanggaling itong 1 over x? Yun yung reciprocal ni number natin. Okay? Now, derive natin. So, ds over dx, dx is equivalent to 1. So, derivative nito, 1 half, uh, quotient n, okay? Uh, derivative of quotient. So, equivalent yan sa 1 over x squared. So, 1 minus 1 over x squared. Yan yung derivative nito. So, then, equate na rin to 0. 1 minus 1 over x squared is equivalent to 0. Okay? Kunin natin yung value. Hmm. Okay? So, ang magiging value natin dito, x squared is equivalent to 1. Therefore, x will be positive and negative 1. Okay? Now, now, since x is a positive number, okay, positive number, x is equivalent to positive 1. Okay, ayan. And then, uh, so ito na yung sagot natin na hinahanap. 1. Ans. Yan yung positive number. Next. Kunin natin yung second derivative. So, over the x squared is equivalent to per second derivative. So, i-derive lang natin to. So, ang sagot natin dyan ay 2 over x cubed. Okay? And then, if x is equivalent to positive 1, so, uh, d squared s or dx squared is equivalent to, so 2 over 1 cubed is equivalent to 2, where n2 is greater than 0, diba? So, thus, s is a minimum, okay? So, na-probe natin yung minimum na sinasabi sa problem minimum. Okay? And then, ang positive number natin ay equivalent to 1. Okay? So, yan yung sagot natin. Ans. S is a minimum and X is equivalent to positive 1. So, yan si application of maximum and minimum.